Cláudia é foda, né? What's good, YouTube? How y'all doing today? It's your boy, the one and only King Trent TV. I'm back for another video. I'm back to talk about the Baltimore Ravens. Ladies and gentlemen, the Baltimore Ravens have made a nice signing. It's a deaf signing, but it's a nice it's a nice signing, but a deaf signing. So the Baltimore Ravens have signed Laquan Treadwell to a one-year deal. They have signed the former Minnesota Viking, former Jaguar, former I leave Cardinal and former uh, Seattle Seahawks Laquan Tread Trenton Tread well. You know what I'm saying? So um well, let's talk about this move real quick. This move right here is like a insurance I would say it's insurance. It's an insurance piece. It's very it's an insurance piece, it's a um piece that, that can help the Ravens in the long run just in case somebody get hurt or you know what I'm saying just in case somebody get hurt for real and um yeah and this guy uh Treadwell apparently I, I watched his highlights he can make some good catches I ain't gonna lie he keeps a I would say he's like a chain mover what I mean is by that he get open he get the chains running you know what I'm saying he, he moves the chains and that's good if he's catching he's get first he that means he gets first downs he definitely get first downs and he also can burn some people he can maul some people i've seen sometimes when they threw the ball up and he make the contested catches as well and the ravens need somebody that can make the contested catches and um yeah this man um trent will is really good he's i mean he played for old miss you know what i'm saying back in the day when in 2015 he played for old miss 2016 he was drafted by the minnesota vikings and here and on from there his career been up and down i would say his career been like more on a downside i would say of his career on a downside why i say on the downside because he's been team hopping you know saying teams been cutting him and he's just been going to different teams each year he never stayed put into it stay put on the roster stay put on the team and um he just never had that shot never got that chance to really stay put and um stay with a good team and all that so maybe this could be a uh this could be a signing where that can help the ravens you know what i'm saying push the needle a little bit whereas they don't have to play odell beckham too much plays where they don't have to play with Sean Bateman too much. You know what I'm saying? Plays they don't even have to really play Devin Duvernay too much. They think veterans. They don't have to play their veterans way too much on a season so they don't get hurt. They can probably put like plug in guys like Trey Will you know what I'm saying? For like key plays down the line to kind of save and restore our best players like Odell Beckham, restore everybody you know what I'm saying? Restore the good players you know what I'm saying? That we got on the field and also you know what I'm saying? keep this keep the injury level down because you know the injury bug is something when it comes to baltimore hopefully this year we don't get that hopefully this year we definitely don't get the uh injury bug because i ain't gonna lie the injury bug is not we can't we can't afford to get people hurt you know what i'm saying we can't afford that we can't afford to get hurt you know what i'm saying this is a super bowl bus team right now we are in the making of a super bowl and bus team and we definitely do not want to get hurt on this on this type of good year on this type of year right now and the ravens we got all the pieces on the world we got the wide receivers we got the titans we got the o-line and we got the running backs we got the probably the best offense that lamar jackson has have in some time this is probably the best offense that he have got better he's better got a better wide receiver core he got better tight end room he got a better o-line and he has a better running back room behind them and also if you want to talk about defense better defense behind them too you got you know what I'm saying the two safeties better two safeties better i would receive linebacker the linebacker duo uh roquan smith and patrick queen better the defensive line a little shaky it's a little shaky in there i say it's a little shaky i say a little shaky because this year, the defensive line is more younger. It's more younger. It's not that much veterans because Calais Campbell has left. So the defensive line is, is much younger. So we got to see how good is that going to play out? How good can we get to the quarterback? 
you know what I'm saying, this year. Also, you know what I'm saying, the edge rushes and stuff too. Like, I want to see, I definitely want to see David Ajabo. <clears throat> I want to see David Ajabo. And I want to um, see um, Owe. You know what I'm saying? David Ajabo and Dafe Owe get to the quarterbacks. Especially, I want to see a David Ajabo because I never seen him play in a Ravens uniform before. And hopefully, I want to see how good he can perform this year off of that uh, Achilles injury he had last year. I want to see how good he is. And also, I want to see Tyler Bowser step his game up. I want him to go be a level, a Pro Bowl type level, um, Pro Bowl type level type of guy. You know what I'm saying? Let's get this man Pro Bowl status up. We gotta get that Pro Bowl status up for my boy. So, pretty much, yes. Yeah, so the Ravens have signed uh, Laquan Treadwell, and um, yeah, it's a insurance piece, like I said, and um, hopefully he can perform and. Um, yeah, spot on the roster. He's just a preseason piece as of right now. He's just signed him here just to have competition with the wide receivers that we got. But I definitely want to see how if he can make a spot on the team and make a spot on the roster. Maybe he can take somebody else's spot, but we're going to see. And maybe it's a big move. It's probably another, speaking of it before I leave, it might be a number, it might be another big move that the, that the Baltimore Ravens might make might be another big move that the Baltimore Ravens might make and I'm not saying that it might be wide receiver but it could be coming from the defense and we might make a big move for the defense just never know never know so that's all I got for today just have a blessed day stay blessed my kids stay blessed adults and also hit that comment type in that let me know how y'all feel about this move that the Ravens made by in the comment section below also hit the like bell and also subscribe to the channel i catch y'all later peace out my friends Bye.